Sink is shining, but I'm not whining. I'm I'm just a baby stepping in. Hey, everybody, I'm Marla Silly, the Fly Lady, and thank you for joining us on Fly Lady TV as we all strive to have a productive new year. We are so excited about the possibilities. Most of us just want a clean house. That's why we think getting organized is going to make our home spotless. Well, we've been wishing for this for a very long time. It isn't until we start taking some actions that we can see the changes come to life. For me, that fateful day was January 1st back in 1999. I set out with the same New Year's resolution. It wasn't until I looked hard at my personality that I realized I had never established a habit for anything that would be considered productive. Oh, I had habits all right. They were ineffective habits that kept me spinning my wheels all day long. I had to make a change. I picked shining my kitchen sink. I was determined to not pile on and be mean to me. This is why I only practiced one habit at a time. I figured it was much easier to focus on one thing and then piggyback any new habit to that one that was already established. Guess what? It worked. Each month I practiced a new habit. I was building my routines. My morning routine consisted of three things. Make the bed, get dressed to lace up shoes, and dust mop my floors. My afternoon routine was to put out my hotspot, answer some emails, and then decide what's for dinner. My evening routine was to pick out my clothes for tomorrow, check my calendar, and shine my sink. These simple routines were the dance for my day. I wrote them down so I could see them. Eventually, they were automatic and my home was practically cleaning itself. I said this to a reporter once and she told me, that is a bold-faced lie. No house cleans itself. That's when I began to walk her through my morning routine. When my feet hit the floor, I make my bed as fast as I can. Then I head to the bathroom and get dressed to lace up shoes. And while I'm in there, I swish and swipe my bathroom. I grab a load of laundry and take it to the washer and start it. Then I start my computer while I make my coffee. While the coffee is brewing, I dust mop my floors. This takes me about 15 minutes from start to finish. Then that reporter said, I've been making my bed for 30 years. And I told her, I rest my case. You already know the power of routines. Habits are the building blocks of our routines. Our routines are the three-step dance that keep our home on automatic pilot. With our routines, we don't have to think. We don't have to make lists and we don't have to feel guilty. Things get done and sometimes we don't even realize that we've done them. Here's an assignment for you. Write out a simple three-step routine for the morning, afternoon, and evening. And post it where you can see it. As you practice it every day, you're going to see your stress level go down. The power of your routines will give you your dreams. We want you to have a home that cleans itself. And this can happen when you harness the power of your routines. We even have a song for you. It's from our Up Kind of Day CD. I'm Marla Silly, the Fly Lady, and I'll catch you next time on Fly Lady TV when we're going to give you the secret to flying. Thanks for watching, and don't forget, this is a great time to check out realforme.com forward slash health. And be sure and sign up for the well-being. Well, my sink is shining, but I'm not whining. I'm I'm just a baby stepping and I'm not obsessing, I'm flying.